Corsair HS65 Surround Review The Corsair HS65 Surround is lightweight at 282 grams, with pleasant memory foam ear pads clad in leatherette. The ear pads do not snugly cover my ears, having a space at the bottom part that doesn't seal even with headband adjustment. Nevertheless, it's comfortable and appears weightless, and the ear pads never press too tightly against my glasses. Each headphone can be flattened, making it convenient to store the headset. The headset alone has a point as well switch of volume control on the rear of the left ear cup. The headset has a mic that deactivates when you turn it upwards. You can change the mic volume and side tone in the Corsair IQ software. The Corsair HS65 surround embraces near wellness and adaptability when it comes to compatibility. It will smoothly operate with any system with the constant or apparatus that contains either a 3.5mm jack plug or USB a port. The headset software capabilities are exclusively defined for Windows PCs and Mac OS, including the PlayStation 4 and 5, Xbox One and Series 10 S, Nintendo Switch, Steam Deck, and phones. Downloading Corsair IQ is a must if you're looking to access its specialized software features. For PC and Mac users, this program enables 7.1 virtual surround sound, enables sound profile modifications, adjusts microphone levels, and There is also a characteristic known as Sound ID that guides you through different sound profiles. Before stating a preference between one or the other with the aim of having an individualized output, however, find that less beneficial. By simply pressing the small button labeled stereo in the lower left corner, you can enable surround sound. This is fun with a gimmicky feature may not necessarily be the effect of the ear. For PC users, the Corsair HS65 surround is equipped with software features. To use the headset's microphone, you'll have to either plug in the adapter directly into your PC's headphone or microphone combo jack. The Corsair HS65 has more bass and higher frequencies in the 2 to 11 kHz range than our standard curve, ideal for gaming but not for music. With this headset, the high-pitched percussion in Charlie XCX's Vroom Vroom is highlighted. Yet the bass boost is not as prominent due to the song prioritizing sub-bass frequencies over a wider range of bass frequencies. While making the bass line louder than usual due to its bass frequency boost. On top of that, Grian Chatton's voice is further amplified, especially his breaths and other mouth sounds, due to the headset's high-range emphasis.